Welcome to a very special video. Before we start, I want to shout out AD Edits. He makes awesome Star Wars edits and actually premiered a teaser trailer of the Kenobi series yesterday at 8 a.m. that he made. And it was pretty awesome. Go check out his channel as well as the teaser trailer he made in the description. So, I haven't heard much updates or any news for that matter on the Kenobi series regarding the trailer and the script. I think AD Edits just did a phenomenal job on the teaser trailer and it seems so real. I think it's actually the teaser, but comment your thoughts on this amazing fan-made trailer. It starts off with the Jawas Sandcrawler and foreshadowing from Yoda from Revenge of the Sith. In your solitude on Tatooine training I have for you, with Kenobi looking out with his robe covering half of his face, such as in Season 6 of The Clone Wars when Qui-Gon pulled Yoda to Dagobah and trained him to become a Force Ghost as well as see the future of Order 66. Yoda instructed Obi-Wan in Revenge of the Sith to go to Tatooine to protect the boy. Now, he has training for Kenobi to learn how to become a Force Ghost like he said in Revenge of the Sith. He talks about Revenge of the Sith with flashbacks to the battle with Anakin with multiple flashbacks through his entire life ever since meeting Anakin as a nine-year-old on Tatooine to picking up his lightsaber and watching him burn. We also hear a Darth Vader breath which means lots of things including Obi-Wan knowing about Vader and him making an appearance in the Kenobi series. With an unknown man, he walks along the ledge of a cliff. cliff talking about how the desert tears you apart and lets you see who you truly are. We are then taken to Mose Eisley, and might I say the visual effects are amazing for this trailer. Very well done. Konami looks up and sees a Star Destroyer in the atmosphere and a TIE Fighter flying overhead. It changes to, again, walking through the desert having flashbacks of a live-action Satine, who is played by Kate Blanchett. Remember, my dear Obi-Wan, I've loved you always which is amazing, but by putting in Satine, I always will. After that foreshadow from the Clone Wars, it then shows him looking out into the horizon, then burying his face inside his robes in disappointment. He's then talking to a Force ghost, who I can't quite make out who it is, but says I'll stay as long as it takes forever to witness the end, and shows the Kenobi opening logo and Darth Maul's voice, saying, Kenobi. Kenobi. That's it for this video. Make sure to check out the actual video for this, created by AD Edits. Awesome job, and we'll just have to wait for the actual teaser trailer. And when it does come out, yes, I will be breaking down the actual trailer. So, stay tuned for that, and may the force be with you.